Hello Pisces, this is your reading for the 28th through the 29th. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome. Please like, share, subscribe, comment. Thank you guys for coming to check me out. And um, let's get started with Pisces in love. Please show me messages for Pisces in love for the 28th through the 29th. Pisces. Eight of Swords. I feel a lot of worrying going on, you guys. What's what's happening? What is happening? What are you thinking about? I'm feeling you want to know the truth around something here. Something about um something that's been unclear for you guys for a while. Something somebody did to you. Feeling like somebody wronged you, okay? Five of Swords. Want to cut through the confusion. Wanting to fight through this fog. Wanting to see things clearly. I also see somebody wanting to release you guys from, from you know, this mental prison that you have entrapped yourselves in. I, I'm getting that somebody wants to fight for you. Yeah, somebody's definitely wanting to fight for you. I feel like for a long time this person has been fighting their feelings, okay? They probably were somebody that, um, you know, hit a lot of things. They weren't as open with how they felt as you would have liked for them to be, okay? Aquarius energy here. King of Pentacles. Yeah, definitely somebody that I feel like was not really in touch with their emotions, okay? They were really trying to, I feel, be a hard ass, to be honest with you, just to be quite frank. Please show me more about the Eight of Swords. The sun. You guys just want to be happy. But there's something that you guys, I feel like, have become aware of. There's something you've become aware of here. Somebody wants to be happy with you. And maybe, you know, somebody has been trying to fight for you guys, trying to tell you, um, trying to tell you the truth and maybe you guys are just not really wanting to see the truth maybe you just not want to see them maybe they hurt you too badly please show me more about the five of swords the ace of cups I definitely feel like somebody wants to start over they see happiness with you I feel like you guys have been scorned you've been burned here though because of the past behavior because of the hard ass attitude this individual um, has had with you. Not really telling you how they feel when you guys, when they had you guys and you were in a good spot, you know? Please show me more about the moon. Yeah, two of cups there. I feel like somebody definitely is trying to reconnect with you. They wanna cut you free. They know that they left you with a lot of unanswered questions. And I'm feeling like this person is wanting to um, try to make things right with you. Okay. Because the fact of the matter is they do um, have a lot of deep feelings for you guys. Okay. Please show me more about the King of Pentacles. Please show me more about the King of Pentacles. The King of Wands. Yes. You have their attention now. Before they were basically being a hard ass, ignoring their feelings, looking away from, you know, how they really felt. Now, this King of Wands is ready to take action, is looking right at the Two of Cups. Okay. You have their attention. Okay. Let's see what energy is coming towards Pisces. They really love you. They do. 
and they know they messed up. What energy is coming towards Pisces? What energy is coming towards Pisces? The Five of Cups. They're regretful. They're regretful about what they did. They feel like you guys, that you're not going to want to like take them back, reconnect with them. Okay. They feel like they really messed up. They know they were an asshole. <laughs> Bottom line. They know they caused you a lot of grief. They know they did. They know you feel betrayed. They know you feel hurt. They basically know they brought it on themselves, okay? Why is this happening? Why is this happening? The High Priestess. They're following their heart. I feel like there has definitely been some communication, unspoken communication between you guys. They know they held back a lot. You guys probably have not been talking. They feel really hurt in this situation. And that is not to take away from the hurt that, that you guys have felt or experienced here, okay? But I'm just show, telling you how what's going on right now, okay? What else? The Queen of Swords. They really don't feel like you guys, not that you won't take them back, but they feel like you've changed. They feel like, you know, you're not as receptive emotionally as um, you once were. And um, they feel like you'll cut their head off. They feel like, you know, you probably will not accept them back. But they don't know this. But they're very, they're very, they know you're not as open to the bull crap. Okay. Um, they know what they've done. Basically, in this situation. But they really want to come back. They really do love you guys. They know they messed up, but um, they don't really see you as the as the the very emotional Pisces that um, you probably once were. They see you as a Queen of Swords, not taking any bullshit, cutting out shit. Okay, see that sword down there? They see you on guard. And you probably weren't before. You were very open. But they don't know anything because I don't feel you guys have been talking. So um, they are worrying themselves here basically for nothing. Because they don't know what's going on. I don't see any wands here. So I don't see any action being taken. All I see is thinking and swords. I see somebody ready to take action wanting to take action but not not yet anyway okay so we have Gemini Aquarius um, Cancer Leo maybe Libra's here and um, Scorpio Taurus Virgo Capricorn individual as well okay all right, guys, so that's what I have for you, and um, I'll be speaking with you.